tip of the thumb if you need to, okay? Depends on your style. The knuckle of the thumb has to show before the start. After we go, you're allowed to regrip if you need to, okay? And don't make sure the two shoulders has to be square before we start the match. One elbow can be sl slightly slanted higher or lower, it doesn't matter. As long as it's square shoulders before we start. So no one gains an advantage on the start, okay? Everything's clear so far? Also, the referee needs a fist distance between the hand and the person's face or body, okay? The referee leg rolls. You can do what you want with the legs. You can during the match or after the match or before the match. You like to grab and push on those legs, any legs you want, as long as you do not interfere with your opponent. That but don't do that. You can change someone's voice very drastically, all right? <laughs> or concentration, whatever. You twist the wrist inside, you're allowed to go over and over the top, you're allowed to move it with Stallone, you're allowed to move your shoulders as you wish, the elbow has to stay on that hand, and that the center line. Center line. Stay in line with that shoulder. Okay, this will be called a foul. Okay, now to the pin top. Number 12 here, okay? So you do not allow any mistakes. One mistake, you lose the match. Kevin will be demonstrating for the kid. It has to be the loser's hand that's got to we'll let you know, okay? So you have to go below the line, the loser's hand. Any questions? My French is coming up. Okay, ready, go. The two elbows come up and back down. We stop the match in this case. Joey Costello and Alain Blanchard. And he's taking on, again, Joey Costello from first. On deck in this class, we have Dave Knox and Rob Weber. Dave McEwen gets a bye. Black shirt 
is from the Wasaga Beach, Collingwood area. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on, Rusty! 